sunshines. Fuckers. Ugh, I go on trail, man. Shit. Out the door at 6.15 this morning, man. I'm digging this. Early start the last few days. My body's rested, so why the fuck not? Get a head start on the fucking heat. God damn that view, man. I wish I had that for my tent last night. <sighs> Slept good last night, though. Um, so, we're 50 miles from Ridgecrest, the town of Ridgecrest. Oh, I gotta stop in there and resupply for a few days. Uh, push me on the Kennedy Meadows. So, um, I reckon we'll do 20 today, 20 tomorrow. We're all on there Wednesday. Today's Monday. So, that is the plan as of now. I'm only hauling two liters this morning because we got pretty good water coming up for the next several miles stretch. So, hell yeah. Nice and cool out. It's gonna be a gorgeous fucking day, I can tell. That sun hitting the fucking mountains already. Holy shit. All right, let's get on down the trail, man. It's gonna be a great fucking day. You know, I've mentioned it before that through hiking has pretty much ruined me permanently. <laughs> Meaning, you know, I, I noticed this when I got back to the real world after the trail last year, going on weekend trips and shit with Roscoe, although fun and amazing, it just, it's just not the fucking same. It's just not the fucking same. Getting up every fucking day in a tent and just hiking all goddamn day and repeating it over and over again. There's something just so fucking amazing about that I absolutely love. Um, but with that being said, it's crazy, but I've been thinking a lot about <laughs> just fucking car camping. Just like getting back home to North Carolina and going to the fucking Linville Gorge or something, parking my ass in a fucking, you know, reserved camping spot and bust out a big ass Wally World four person tent and my Coleman stove and shit and just cook pancakes and bacon and sausage and don't even fucking hike just sit there all goddamn day in a comfy fucking chair drinking Diet Coke and listening to the goddamn birds chirp all fucking day that shit sounds appealing to me <laughs> I've had dreams about it the last few days I think that's why when all this trail business is done well long trails is done I'm going to be the best free shitter of all time because I want to be that asshole sitting at a road crossing just passing out soda and beer for the Elkies and kicking up fucking pancakes and burgers and hot dogs. I cannot fucking wait to do that. <sighs> Coming to the AT soon. I'll be tapped free shitter extraordinaire all up and down that bitch. <laughs> Growing me a second breakfast, man. Lander's Meadow Campground. <clears throat> There's a jug over here. Spring, pipe spring, whatever. Well, so the next reliable, reliable water source is 35 fucking miles from here. Now, 
thumbing thumb through Gut Hook's comments, there are a couple well-maintained water caches, one at seven miles from here, another at like 20 or 22 from here. So, yes, you cannot rely on that shit 35 miles is a long fucking time to be banking on a water cache that could be fucking dry. But uh, the Gut Hook's comments say that both those caches were stocked like three days ago. There's like 70 gallons at both, so... Chances are there'll be water, but I'm still going to haul my capacity from here. Take a lot of siestas when it gets hot. Stay in the shade. Conserve my fucking water. I'm not doing that whole fucking 35 miles today. Because <laughs> I've already done like, what, 7 miles? That'd be over 40 miles a goddamn day. Fuck all that noise. So, Anywho, rest up, camel up, and we'll push on for the day, man. With a lot of goddamn water. Shit, mine. I see snow on that mountains over there. <laughs> right now I decided to spare the one mile down to the water because I figured every goddamn hiker and their brother would be down there drooling over the fucking water cache so I found me a nice little rock with shade I'm gonna enjoy my fucking lunch here man <laughs> Alright, fuckers, back on trail, man. Shit. Oh, that was fucking lovely. Whoever supplies these water caches, thank you, thank you, thank you. It's it's big time, man. Nine miles to go. Shit, we're gonna pull off that 30 today, goddammit. <sighs> Finally got soul service today. Sarah Sunstrom. Wow, you don't have to be such a jerk. I have done the trail. I know how hard it is, but when you're putting out videos and expect criticism, that's just life. Roll with it. Well, fuck you. Anywho, <sighs> it's been a taxing goddamn day in the sun, man. <laughs> Pacific Crest Trail, Appalachian Trail. <laughs> Five and a half miles to camp. Look at those fucking clouds. Got a jackrabbit staring me down. Yeah, you better take off, bitch.
fucking miles. My feet feel it. I got a killer fucking dirt tan going on. <sighs> it was hot, man. I'm glad I did the last whatever the fuck it was, 15 in the evening. Oh, uh, once it cooled off, it wasn't too bad. But by that time, my feet were fucking screaming. But this fucking water cache here. <sighs> Holly fucking Louie, man. If it wasn't for this shit, I only had like a liter on me. That would have been another 12 fucking miles to water. And I already did 30 up to here. I was fucking cashed out, but... Anywho, I gotta set up my shit and stuff my face. I'm gonna fuck up some goddamn mashed potatoes. We'll holler at you motherfuckers in the morning. All my bones are dislocated. I just keep on wandering.